Good morning everyone and welcome back to another video. It is Saturday morning, I am up very early this morning, or fairly early for a Saturday anyway, considering I'm not actually working today, because I'm going back to the town that I used to live in and I'm gonna have a facial this morning, hence the no makeup face, excuse the lovely spot that appears to be growing on my chin, I mean, it's always the way, but hopefully the facial will help to get rid of that once and for all. But yeah, I am very much looking forward to it. It's the first facial I have had since, gosh, I think it must be since like before the pandemic began. It, it's got to be a good year longer possibly since I've had a facial. So I'm very much looking forward to it. It's a hydrodermy one. I'm not entirely sure what that involves, but we will find out. So I might vlog a little bit when I'm there, probably not much though, but I might just kind of show you the room that I'm in and little bits and pieces of it. But um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. As with the rest of the day, the weather is pretty poor out there today, so not going to be doing too much outside, I don't think. We will go to the gym later. I also want to go to the supermarket at some point to pick up some bits because tomorrow I've got some girlfriends coming over for afternoon tea in the garden. So I'm very, very much hoping the weather is going to improve for tomorrow, but I'm not entirely sure it will. But anyway, we're going to do it, come rain or shine. So... Um, so yeah, I've got that tomorrow, so I'll pick up some bits for that today and I'll show you what I get, so I'm looking forward to that. I had afternoon tea a while ago now and they had, instead of the jam and cream, they had lemon curd with the cream and it was lovely. So I'm thinking that I'm going to get some lemon curd, I'll get jam as well, but I thought that maybe I'll get some lemon curd as a little choice. Oh, here she comes, hello darling, you okay? <laughs> She's just been eating her breakfast, bless her. So, um, yeah, that is the plan for today. I'm just going to let her out to go for a wee. Come on in, darling, you go for a wee ways. Good girl, good girl. Um, yeah, so that is the plan for today. And, yeah, obviously tomorrow I've got my friends coming over for afternoon tea. So I just thought I would bring you along with, the, with me this weekend, just seeing what we get up to. And, yeah, hopefully you find it of interest. I don't think I've got anything else to say, so I'll catch you all in a little bit. I just thought I would do a quick outfit of the day because I really, really love this jacket. Um, it's, if I come up a little bit closer, it's got really, really lovely sort of pearl detailing and gold thread going through it. It's so gorgeous. I've actually had it for a little while, but you know, lockdown, I've not worn it. But um, yeah, it's got nice kind of padded shoulders and yeah so this is today's little outfit quite casual but enough adds a little bit of something extra with the jacket and then my gorgeous chanel here as well so off we go for our facial look at this weather this rain Ugh. and i have just seen people running like actually running what is that about what why why would you do that i mean there's dedication and then there is dedication am i right i mean i've never been a runner personally i just i find it quite boring personally and it hurts my knees it really hurts my knees so it's not really my cup of tea i mean i take my hat off to anyone that runs because it's just it's an it's a great form of exercise um although not particularly good for your joints but a great form of exercise and yeah i mean they just seem to go out come rain or shine and i just don't have that same dedication so um yeah you might be able to hear my windscreen wipers going guys if you're wondering what that noise is the weather is so pants so pants but on the drive over they did have playing on the radio backstreet boys which always cheers me up a bit of leanne rhymes you can't beat a bit a bit of leanne rhymes too so that was good coyote ugly is probably one of my all-time favorite favorite films it's such a good film um i always had the dreams of dancing on a bar i mean great aspirations but uh it's such a good film so good I actually think I should watch that at some point this weekend or yeah at some point I'm not sure it's Jamie's cup of tea we'll see I mean hot girls dancing on a bar how is that not any man's cup of tea we'll see 
anyway so i am outside the salon um i'm a little bit early so i just thought i would have a quick chat to you whilst i'm waiting and yeah so excited for this very very excited So I've just pulled up home. Hello darling. Hi. What have you been doing? You've been snoozing with daddy? Have you? I thought you would have. Come on in. Come on in. Oh there look. Blankets all snuggled up on the sofa. It's the first time I've come home and you've not been here, so I thought. I'd yeah, it's the first time I've not been teaching in the uh, living room, isn't it? So, you've been napping? No, I've not napped yet. Not yet. You've got to wait for me for a nap. Yeah, you moved the blanket off and was sitting on the sofa again. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whenever we go out, we put this throw on the sofa because we want Betty to be able to lay on it, but equally, we want. To protect the sofa but she's got into the habit of, of moving the throw and just laying on the sofa haven't you yeah like that <laughs> you little pickle bum what are you doing you're sniffing my jeans <sighs> yeah you're a little pickle bum aren't you look at that guys that facial was heavenly absolutely heavenly it's such a nice little treat to yourself and actually my skin feels and looks so much more kind of plump and revitalized other than that spot but that's all right it's, it's on its way out it's on its way out guys so uh, yeah it makes me think i need to do it more often actually to really get the benefits out of it and it's such a nice little treat to yourself isn't it she actually massaged into my neck and shoulders um because the, well they do it whilst you have your mask on a lot of the time and yeah i was quite tight so i definitely needed that as well so that was a little bit of a treat hopefully um i'll feel that i've got a little bit of a less stiff neck after that so that is really good and yeah it was just lovely lovely i'm looking forward to actually because i always find the day after you have a facial when you put your makeup on it just goes on so beautifully and so kind of smoothly so i always look forward to kind of put, putting on some makeup the next day so i won't wear any today i don't want to ruin any of the lovely work that she's done but uh yeah i always look forward to doing that the next day i think it always goes on really really nicely and nice and smooth so i think we're going to get to the gym fairly shortly so I'm going to have some porridge actually, um, I've not had anything to eat yet, so I'm going to have something to eat for breakfast and yeah, we'll be off to the gym a little bit later. Good morning guys, it is now the next day, I've got my friends coming over today for afternoon tea. Um, I'm showered and I'm, well, I'm just dressed in my dossy clothes because I've cleaned the house from top to bottom. My hair I've just whacked in a bun and it is just drying naturally, I will sort it out later. But I'm just doing my makeup and I just wanted to show you actually, um, because I've had this delivered today. Now it is a um, New Win Gucci lip, I think it's a lip balm. Oh, oh, look at that colour. Are you going to focus? There we are. It's gorgeous. And just look at this packaging. So, so pretty. Really, really gorgeous packaging. So, I just thought I would try that out today and, yeah, and show you guys in case you're interested. I just have a little chat as I get my makeup ready and get myself yeah, organised and ready for today. So, I've got my mirror here. So, if I keep looking in the mirror here, that's what I am doing. So yeah, guys, I'm really looking forward to my friends coming over. We've not done anything like this because obviously with lockdown, we've not been able to. So not seeing my friends or family really much at all. So it's nice to have some people around, be able to show them the house and all of those kind of things. It's gonna be really, really lovely. Um, so yeah, very much looking forward to it. I bought some bits and bobs yesterday for the afternoon tea. So I'm looking forward to getting that organised and yeah, putting it on some pretty plates and all of that kind of thing. I think that will be really nice. I am not a cook. If you've been around here for a little while, you will fully be aware of my lack of 
cooking skills they are like pretty pretty poor so um it is pretty pretty much all store-bought i feel really awful actually because one of my um friends that's coming today Zena, she's lovely um obviously they're all lovely they're my friends um but she um is basically a chef um <laughs> she's got a cookbook or two cookbooks actually that she's done um in the past which are absolutely incredible and yeah and then she's coming over to my house and i'm like oh this is from sainsbury's like it's just pretty poor show really but um never mind never mind it'll be fine she said she's bringing cupcakes so i'm very much looking forward to having some of those i'm sure that they will be delicious so yeah, I'm just getting myself organised, getting myself ready, putting on some makeup on my face, on my facial yesterday. I mean, I, I know I updated you briefly on it, but it was just so lush. And I think I said to you as well that every time you have a facial, or in my experience anyway, when you put your makeup on the next day, it just goes on so nicely. And so far, that is exactly what is happening. I don't actually use foundation um, at all. I just use concealer as a kind of foundation-y type thing but I just kind of spot put it on spots that I feel like need it rather than just smothering my face with it but um so I mean make up with Alicia because I'm apparently a beauty vlogger not um I wish that'd be amazing right I'm gonna go in with a little bit of bronze now this is a um uh what's it called cream bronzer so good at this so good at this but I actually really like it i saw it because i think i saw another um lady that i follow on youtube um amelia liana i think it was and she used it and it looked so lovely and she had a little discount code going so of course i was like oh i need it i need it so um i bought it but look i think it's quite nice it's quite it's it's not too kind of crazy it's quite subtle and it leaves because it's cream i think it leaves just like a little bit of a sheen which is quite nice almost a little bit of a glow and i do love a bit of glow so i do think that is quite nice there as well what do you guys think is it too much do you like it <laughs> eyes are done now I'm gonna just go in with some mascara um, or I'll just give my eyelashes a quick comb first so one of the best best beauty things that I have ever ever done guys is use Revitalash I don't know if you've heard of it but it's a lash serum and not everyone has amazing amazing results with it but I've got to say I did it was unreal my mum did actually I bought some for her birthday last year and she had some really good results with it. Where's my mascara? There it is. Yeah, she had some really good results with it as well. It does, um, you know, really help your lashes grow. I had lash extensions for a long, long time. And actually, over a period of time, it really destroyed my lashes. That I literally, my natural lashes, they were pretty much non-existent. Um, and so during the first lockdown, I think it was, I bought some Revitalash. And I tried that. You just put it on, I think it's every day you put it on. Yeah, I think it is every night. Every night you put it on and just go to sleep in it. Or I think you can put it on every day, but I just thought it was easier at night because I didn't want to then put makeup on over the top. I think you can, but I just chose not to. Um, and yeah, and it makes your lashes grow beautifully. It was one of the best things I've ever bought. I think. Why do we do that? Why did that happen? <laughs> Especially when you're filming. Oh no. Hold on. Let me just clear myself up. Idiot. Look. I mean. I'm not very good at this, am I, guys? <laughs> I actually don't think it went on the floor anywhere, which is um, a miracle, really, to be honest. So that's good. I've got a beautiful white rug behind me, so uh, very pleased. So it didn't go all over that. I think I can hear Betty Boo outside. Lesser. It's just hoovering and she gets herself in such a state when I hoover. Honestly, she just, I think she thinks it's a game. She's not frightened of it, I don't think. I think she thinks it's a game and she just loves chasing the hoover, which is absolutely fine, but not really ideal when you're actually trying to hoover. <laughs> Bless her. Oh, hello. You're coming in to join us. Are you coming in to say hello, 
Bobo. Where are you? There you are. Hey, Bobo. Betty, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're going to have a lay down on the rug. It is your favourite place. Right, lips. Let's try out this Gucci lips uh, balm. I think it is a balm. What's it called? Uh, lip glow, lip and care lip colour. Okay. Uh, right, where is my liner? Let's go in with a little liner first. Packaging. It's gorgeous. Okay. Oh, it looks like my kind of colour. Oh, it feels lovely. Mm. Oh, I quite like that. What do you think, guys? Do you like it? I really like it. I think it's quite a nice, um, nice little colour there, actually. I think I might get some more. Try the different ones, because this is like obviously a very nudey kind of colour, um, which is kind of a very safe colour to buy, isn't it? But uh, they did have some nice kind of coral colours, which I thought would be nice for the summer months, and some reds, so... Hmm. I might actually try to get a couple more. Should I put it back in its box? I'll put it back. Lovely. Right, so we're going to get my hair done now. Face is done, so let's get my hair done. And then I think it will be time to maybe get the food prepped and ready. Right then, so hair is done. It's looking very, very bouncy, but um, hopefully after um, a little bit of time it will drop out nicely. So yeah, I'm going to get prepared on the food now. Just look at that weather. I don't know if you can tell, but it is throwing it down outside. Oh my goodness. Thank goodness it is Monday and not yesterday. So we are actually allowed to be inside. Thank goodness for that. I mean, look at it. It's horrific. We were actually supposed to be doing this um, yesterday, as I think I told you earlier on in the vlog, but we all got together and decided on our little WhatsApp group that uh, today would be a better option because we can be inside because it poured all day long yesterday. I didn't vlog either yesterday because there was just nothing going on. The weather was pants and we were all free today. So we decided to do it today instead. And um, yeah, at least we can be inside today, even if the weather is pretty pretty poor out there according to my iphone weather app as well it is going to be like this for the next 10 days and that is glorious glorious honestly the weather this weekend has just been awful awful come on it is may it is may what is going on then we are all ready so I've got my trusty denim dress on again today I love this dress it's just perfect for this time of year where the weather is just doing all sorts of weird things so it's an ideal dress for that um, but yeah I'll take you downstairs now and show you the little table setup that I've done I need to learn how to do these beautiful tablescapes that people do because that's something that I would quite like to be able to get better at and to actually be able to do hair's dropped out nicely so yeah let's show you downstairs Okay, so this is the little table set up. So we have got some sandwiches here. I think they are cream cheese and cucumber and then egg mayo. Some little millionaire um, shortbreads. And then I've got my setup here of jam, lemon curd and clotted cream. The scones are in the oven, so they will be ready shortly. And then the sandwiches here are tuna, mayo and prawn mayo. And then just some little cakey bits there. They are lemon slices and salted caramel cake. And yeah, I just wanted to show you these plates actually. Oh, so these um, napkins are the same pattern as the cushions on the sofa. So I like that that all matches nicely. And then we've got the napkin ring. And then I've got these lovely, beautiful, beautiful cakes. I've had these for years. I think they were from Marks and Spencers many years ago, but they all say something different. And they're in these beautiful pastel colors. So this one obviously says, did someone say cake? And then we have got full up over here. 
let's just walk around to the other side and then we have got treat yourself just turn it so it's straight there we go and then last but not least cake conquers all it does it absolutely does and these really beautiful matching um cake knives uh, cake knives cake forks rather that go with them as well so that is my little table set up for my afternoon tea with the ladies. There's Betty. Now, Missy, are you going to let us eat our afternoon tea in peace or are you going to be begging for food at the table? Yep, I think she might be begging for food at the table. So this is the aftermath. We had such a lovely afternoon though, guys. It was so nice to see some friends. Um, Janine bought over some Krispy Kreme. She knows me so well. And yeah, really, really lovely afternoon. I don't know how we're gonna eat all these leftovers, Jamie and I, but hmm, let's face it, we'll give it a good go. So I will leave the video there, guys. We're gonna go into a sugar coma shortly, but I've gotta teach a Zoom class first, so uh, sugar coma will come after that. And yeah, I will catch you all in the next one, guys. Take care.